asimacademy.org. Free computer courses. We are going to create simple input form in Android using Android Studio. First start Android Studio. Then click on start a new Android Studio project. For application name, you can enter whatever you like. I'm going to keep this default value and same for company domain and package name and project location. I will go for default values for this application, then click on next. And over here for Android devices, I'm going to select phone and tablet and the API 15 ice cream sandwich then click on next and for activity i'm going to select basic activity then click on next activity name is your java class name layout name is your xml file which is the design for your screen and the title your screen title and menu resource name is menu underscore main is xml file for menu option we will leave it then click on finish and under resource folder there's a layout folder and under it there is file content underscore main dot xml click on that you can see we are in text mode we, the text tab is selected you can click on design you can see how the screen will look now click on text tab again we are going to change this text in text view component we are going to delete this hello world string and we will type age in this simple form we are going to input users age then save then we are going to come back to design click on design and under palette we need to scroll down a little bit uh, before that we need to change relic layout click on tab text tab again and change this re relative layout to linear layout with linear layout you can add item from top to bottom left to right or from right to left and save then come back to a design again and scroll down and under text field I will select plain text and place it next to age then I will scroll up and under the widget I'm going to select button and place next to the text input field and then I'm going to come back to the text mode by clicking on text tab over here you can see the new components new items that we added to our screen text view the one we modified first then we added added text component and then button object And now we are going to test our application, run it. You can click over here and select your AVD. Okay. Now you can see our application is launched on AVD and you can see age the text and the input field and the button we are going to come back 
to the text mode by clicking on a text tab and for the button we are going to change the value of a text we will type submit and then save and relaunch the application now you can see the submit text on the button for more videos you can visit us at awesomeacademy.org